Welcome back to the YouTube channel, boys and girls. My name is Krogan. In today's video, we're going to be talking about how you guys can up your FPS and up your guys' performance on Xbox, basically with easy, easy steps. So, the first one starts with Fortnite. Obviously, if you're wanting to up your performance, you're most likely playing... Per you're most likely playing PUBG, Fortnite, H1Z1, a high competitive, like, you know need good graphics, need good FPS type game. So you want to start off in Fortnite, you want to be in uh, your settings and you want to go over to your settings icon, which will be right here. And you're going to want to scroll all the way down till you get to the bottom of the settings. And it's going to say replays right here. Record replays. This is going to, if you want to record your replays, you can, but if you do not want your game to be running an extra thing that it doesn't have to and it'll run smoother with it off you guys can turn it off hit apply and that adds like you know just not having to run it in your game all the time it's just like if you were to turn settings on your PC off it'll run faster because there's not as much CPU usage so that's basically uh, it for your Fortnite settings so now you want to go into your Xbox settings if you have an Xbox or PS4 or you know whatever settings you have, you're gonna want to go over to your settings. So click that. Okay. So once you get over into your settings, okay. Can <laughs> this thing is messed up? But you're gonna want to go to Blu-ray. So it's in devices and streaming. And once you go on to Blu-ray, it's gonna have a. Where is it? It's not in here. Oh, persistence or persistent storage. So once you click on persistent storage, if you clear persistent storage, this is all like the files. Like if you download a new version of Fortnite, the old version of Fortnite that you just like scrapped basically goes into your storage. So you still have it, but you don't need it because you're playing on the new Fortnite and those are all just scrap seasons and like, you know, that's the past. So you can clear this and it will make your Xbox run 10 times faster because this is one of the storages that Xbox doesn't really say, hey, this is a, a storage that can be cleared for your Xbox to run faster. So you can clear this storage. Nothing will change. You also have two other backup storages and this isn't even the main one. This is just for devices and streaming. Basically, are all your clips and stuff that like you already clipped. So um, after you go into here and you've done with your Blu-ray settings and you already did that, then you can go to your normal storage. So you want to go over to your storage and you want to clear local save games. No, you want to clear delete save games. This will delete your save games on this console. No, you do not want to do this. I forgot where it is. One second. Let me find it. It's going to be like two seconds. I'm going to get back to you in just a moment. Okay guys, so basically once you guys have figured out all that other storage thing with the uh, devices and streaming down below here in the Blu-ray, the one about the storage right here is going to be coming up in my next video about this because there's a follow-up. There's two other ways, but I'm not going to release them in this video. I'm going to bring another video, so if you guys want to see that one and this one helps your console run better and run faster and produce like more FPS in Fortnite. Uh, drop a like subscribe turn on post notifications comment down below another thing you guys want me to fix on xbox or in general about fortnite because they kind of suck at explaining how to fix stuff so i know there's a bunch of uh websites online that states a bunch of fortnite glitches so i'm going to be checking that today and tomorrow so i can get some more uh, videos uploaded so without further ado that's the end of this video and i'll see you guys next time peace